Wind turbines are bad for the environment, actually. They kill whales, they slice up birds, something else, they're ugly is what. I heard it online, so it must be true. You've probably heard this before, and if you haven't, well, you're about to, because Donald Trump has made like Don Quixote and declared war against windmills. So it's time to find out, are wind turbines bad, actually? Well, I looked into it, probably harder than I needed to, and here's what I found. The National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration notes that there is no specific scientific proof that wind farms are negatively impacting whales, and zero whale deaths have been directly linked to wind turbines. But let's look at the theory just in case. Per the Cape Cod Commission, the installation of wind farms could give off lots of noise that would disturb or confuse the whales. Enough to beach them? Probably not. However, the vast majority of whale deaths can be tracked to something, and that is either entanglement in fishing or getting straight up hit by a boat. Okay, so what about the birds? Well, that one's more true. Wind turbines are responsible for, at the absolute highest estimate, 700,000 bird deaths per year, which is about 0.05% of all of the birds killed by cats and 0.07% of all the birds that fly into buildings. Wind turbines are getting safer, but it is a thing that happens. Despite all these bird fatalities, the Audubon Society, the leading conservation organization for birds, still supports wind power saying that two-thirds of bird species are at risk of extinction anyway because of a little something called global warming, which wind turbines are proven to do something about. And finally, they're ugly. Well, you're right. I'd rather have an all-natural fracking site or oil rig in my backyard.